Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Super Mario 3D Land. In the last episode, we finished off the normal worlds as Luigi. Now we'll be moving on to the special worlds, hopefully doing special world four, or one through four. And with that being said, a lot of you have actually let me know that you don't need to get the golden flagpole as Luigi if you already have gotten as Mario. You just need the flagpole once, but we do need a completion with Luigi each time. So that's all I'll worry about. Maybe this will go even faster. Maybe we'll be able to get more than four worlds done in today's episode. We'll have to wait and see. But yeah, we'll just get to it and hopefully have a good time. It definitely will make it a lot less stressful. Just not having to worry about star medals or golden flagpoles, just simply getting to the end of the level. That'll be good. Let me go ahead and grab the star, perfect. I know we can get quite a few extra lives in this level, not like we need it with 243 in total, but let me snag that and get this other star quickly. Oh, there we go. There's another one, and another one. There we go, this is just fun to do. It's just, it's just fun to get a bunch of lives, take out all the enemies, and I think that's about all of them. When we gained like six lives there, so that's pretty good. All right, whoa, watch it, sir. I got places to be. It is very helpful for Luigi to be jumping higher. He just is able to get through some of these obstacles a whole lot easier. So I'm gonna avoid all you guys and boom. And I hope you guys are right, because if not, <laughs> I'm gonna have to do this all over. But a lot of you said that I don't have to get it as Luigi. I just have to get to the end. And I think that seems about right. So yeah, there we go, we got that done. And we're already good to move on to the next level. I think this is gonna go pretty well. I'm looking forward to it. Let's go on over to S12, which is a cool little cave level. But yeah, this is sort of the main gist of what we gotta do for the next two episodes, is just get some stuff done as Luigi. Oh man, I'm just now thinking, it should have been a dark version of Luigi. Is it still Dark Mario? Uh, let's find out. Uh, there it goes, it took him a second to pop up. It's, yeah, it looks like it's Dark Mario to me. That's sort of a shame. That would've been such a nice little touch if it was Dark Luigi. Oh well. Let's keep going. I got, might as well get the checkpoint. Oh no, I missed it, whatever. It doesn't really matter too much as long as I don't die, which I don't think I will. These first couple worlds are quite easy. Oh man, Luigi's super jumping abilities are amazing. Okay, there we go, there we go. Where's the pipe at? It is not. It has to be up here, isn't it? Um, whoa, whoa. Sometimes it jumps a little too floaty. There we go. Where is the pipe we're looking for? Are we looking for a pipe? Oh yeah, here it is. And we're good. There we go, we're fine. <laughs> Oh, there's a star if we want to take him out. I don't even think we need to. Let's just not waste the time, keep moving. Trying to get as much done as we can. All righty, so there we go, course clear and everything. So far, so good. And our clear time is 64. Seems pretty good to me. All right then, so we're saving up. And we're gonna be moving on over to S13. Oh, this is a fun level. Usually these levels are a whole lot less stressful when you don't have to get the star medals, so it's easier just to pop through it. Let me hop into this cannon and go like that. And then I can skip all this, excuse me, I got places to be. And right up there. There we go. And then I think, yeah, there's some red coins. Once again, I'm not worried about them. Oh, nobody minds, I'm skipping so much stuff, but you know, we've already done it once, so that's fine. Oh wait, no, I missed. I really do like that uh, Luigi at least looks different with the, uh, the leaf than Mario does. That's always a cool little touch. Hold on, let me dodge all this, come on. Oh, it's over here. <laughs> but a lot of you have been asking if I plan on playing any other Mario games after Mario 3D Land, since we're getting very close to the end of this. I will confirm that soon enough, I do plan on playing more Mario. It might not be immediately after Mario 3D Land, but lots of you have been requesting, oh gosh, different games, and I do have a couple in mind. I have already played quite a lot of Mario this year. We played Mario and Luigi U Deluxe. We played, um, oh, oh no, oh no. Okay, for a second, I, I thought I shot too high there. Um, we played Mario and Luigi U Deluxe. We played Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story, but there is more coming, and in the meantime, I am going to be playing uh, Yoshi's Crafted World, which I guess is sort of kind of a Mario game, sort of kind of not, but uh, yeah, that'll be cool. Anyways, there is S13 done. Let's move on over to S14. So almost done with the first special world. In under 10 minutes, that's pretty good. If we could do like 10 minutes of world, then that'd be perfect. Oh yeah, this one as well. A lot of people will also also asking for Mario 3D World, which I guess is sort of kind of the sequel to this one. While I do want to play that, I have a feeling that it'll eventually release on the Nintendo Switch. I mean, almost every worthwhile Wii U game at this point has. So I think that, you know, eventually I definitely will play 3D World. Oh my gosh, this boomerang is still coming for me. But I would like to wait, because I would hate to have to play it, and then like, I mean, not to say I wouldn't like to play it. Hold on, these boomerang dudes are not being very nice. You get out of here, sir. 
but I wouldn't want to play it and then like be halfway through playing it and then they announce like 3D World just got my to the Switch or something silly like that, you know? Um, so I, I'm probably just gonna wait a little while and see what ends up happening. But in the meantime, we got plenty of other things to play. There's so many Mario games, there's like a cabillion of them. All right, whoa, <laughs> gotta be careful. I think we're coming up on the end of this. I'm not letting you get me this time. You've already took away one of my leaves. I don't know, whoa, be careful, be careful. Going around, going around, and boom. Almost got the top of the flagpole right there. That was pretty crazy. All right, so that was the toughest level yet, but we were able to handle it pretty good. And as you can see, we get ourselves another extra life, I think. <coughs> All righty, so one last level for this world. It is going to be S1 Castle. I don't think we need to clear the mystery boxes, Luigi, do we? I don't think so. But I mean, I guess if we have to, it wouldn't be, it would take me like a five minutes to go back and do them all. They only take a second each. Um, let's go ahead and grab that. And yeah, we gotta be careful of all of the fireballs because we don't wanna lose our power up here when we have so little time. There we go, got that extra 10 seconds. Excuse me, sir, I got places to be. Oh, definitely grab that. There we go, we got a little extra one. Okay, this can go up, whoa. Gotta be careful, Luigi's jumping and he's moving around, he's extra slippery. Is this sort of exactly like a Super Luigi U, or new Super Luigi U? Uh, whoop, gotcha. There we go, looking pretty good so far. No, no, wait, 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 hold on, that's not good, gotta be careful. Don't squish me. There it is, there it is. And, oh, oh, not bad. Okay, there's an extra couple of seconds. I know Bowser's gonna pop up here. Oh, Dry Bowser, I forgot. <laughs> Pretty cool. He's not very happy with me. That's fine with me. We should be able to handle him. Nonetheless, I could probably, depending on how he does things here. Oh, no, wait, wait, let me grab this. You know, this might be a bit risky, but it's so worth it. Oh, it's so worth it. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> be careful, be careful. Hold on. There you go, see ya. That is excellent. I almost messed it up, but we didn't, luckily. Jeez, that was close. <laughs> All right, see ya, Bowser. Better luck next time. So there we go, world one is completed with Luigi once we get out of here, as soon as this door opens. There we go. And go through here, and pop up this side. For the first time, I'm not climbing up these boxes. I'm just gonna go like this. There we go, <laughs> two coins, <laughs> nothing too crazy. But there we go, world one of four done. And under 10 minutes, like I said, so very good. Course clear. So with that one done, we get ourselves another couple of coins. Our clear time is 107. Don't think that's any kind of record, but still pretty cool. And now we can move on to special world two. Where are we, oh no, this level's not so fun. The auto-scrolling levels aren't gonna be all that much faster because I can't control the camera. Uh, this one's a tough one too. I mean, I think it'll be fine because we have everything. We don't have to worry about star medals or anything like that. But I am a bit worried just because it can be tough. Let's get rid of this stuff. Oh, there we go. Going up that way, good job, Luigi. Let's get rid of this guy, there we go. Trying to use our uh, a little spin move whenever I had the chance because these guys aren't so friendly. I think they might spit fireballs, or at least some of them do. Oh, these guys do. Luckily, they're a bit visually different, and some of the Mario games are not. They look exactly the same as other Piranha Plants. They just also happen to spit fire. Not the case with uh, these guys, though. Okay, there we go. Just gotta be careful. And looking good. There we go, that was pretty cool. I actually don't want that, so let's not take it. I think this is the hard part of the level we're coming up to. I mean, the whole thing is the hard part, to be honest with you. But the part we're coming up on certainly is not easy. I'm gonna just chill out up here if I can. Oh, the clouds getting in the way is not helpful. Oh yeah, I remember that part. <laughs> That's where I donked my head and fell all the way back down. Okay, I think we're almost done. Well, let's hope that's the case. Oh, there we go, there we go, and we are done. So I can ignore this piranha plant and we can just hop like that, very cool. So, another level completed. We did pretty good with that one. And we're already storming through Special World 2. 
115 seconds that time. I don't think that's gonna be anything spectacular, but I'm glad to have it. All right, so saving up, and we're gonna do uh, Special World 3 now. And I don't know, it's weird that we only have 294. I thought that there were 300 star medals in this game, but I might be wrong. Like maybe I missed something, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like people would have let me know that. It just seems like a weird number to stop on. Anyways, let's go this way. Get this little clock right here. Got it, very nice. But yeah, like I was saying before, I would love to hear suggestions for if you have another Mario game you'd love to see me play. We've played quite a lot of them at this point, but I'm always, uh listening to whatever you guys want to see. There we go, hold, hold on, there we go. And I don't think there's anything up there, so we can just pop down this way and grab this little clock. Trying to like rush through this level, but also grab the clocks, which means I need to explore it pretty well. There we go, and then Mr. Blooper, I need you to skedaddle. Thank you for skedaddling. And I will grab that. Okay, we're looking pretty good here. We're actually building up quite a lot of time. Once again, just avoid the blooper. That was a close one. Okay, good to get a couple of extra coins, but not really the one I'm trying for. I think, yeah, the giant snake monster's coming up. Leave me alone, Mr. Monster. Okay, and let's get over here and slam. I think that was a little bit faster. Okay, grab that, and we are good, maybe, if I didn't miss the pipe. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna run out of time. Oh cool, and we even got this. No oh, wait, whoa, no, dip, dip, never mind. <laughs> Okie doke, so S22 is completed. That one took a little bit longer, but that's fine. Course clear. Luigi seems excited. I still love the fact that when he jumps in the air like that, just for a second, his mustache sort of blends in with his sideburns, making him look like he has a super crazy huge mustache. That's just wonderful. It'd be cool if he could play like Wario or something in this game. Like I know that was with with, with a Mario 64 DS. You could play as some of the different characters. I feel like they need more 3D Mario games like that. They had that for 3D World, but I think like for proper 3D Mario's would be fun. Like I know that they made Luigi's Balloon World, but you couldn't play Luigi in it. Like how cool would it have been if you could play Luigi in that one? I know you could do that in uh, Mario Galaxy. Oh boy, there we go. There we go. And. Uh, be careful, ow. Okay, well I got one and then I lost one. I might as well get it, no, no! No, my items, they're all gone. That stinks. Oh well, <laughs> that was just silly. All right, let me get across to here as soon as I can. And now I feel so vulnerable. And I could try to, no, okay, I gotta be careful because I don't want to get hurt. Okay, no, it's not worth it, just keep moving. And jump. We're doing so well too until I lose all my items. Long jump across, grab that, and on to another moving platform of doom. These are always my least favorite levels. They're just so stressful. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. So I should, ah, that's not what I want. That's like basically the opposite of what I wanted. Okay, hold on. Grabbing that, grabbing this. It's likely that I'm gonna run out of time here before I get these. Ah, oh, man, oh, and I fell anyways, come on. That could not have gone any worse than what it did. And now I'm all, all the way over here. I, I probably shouldn't have even gotten the checkpoint. Would have been better off if I just uh, kept with what I had because I you know I know there's that guaranteed stone leaf right at the beginning. So that's sort of the downside of uh, Luigi having a bit of a floatier jump is it can be, especially in these sort of tighter areas, harder to get him to do exactly what you want. Oh no, almost too. Well this time I'll just be a little bit careful. We'll move this way. I think we're getting close to the end of the level anyways, but it's just such a pain, because now I won't have powers for the other parts of the level. Or not the other parts of the level, the other parts of the world. I mean, hopefully we can earn some up soon. Um, 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 excuse me. Well, that was a little delayed. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I gotta pay a little bit more attention. There we go, okay, I got this this time. Hopefully that'll be good. It was so tough to get us Luigi. I don't know why he's so slippery, but he is. So I gotta time these good this time. This one pops up no problem, and I can jump across, easy peasy. But then it's this one. That's a little bit of a trouble. Come on, come on, come on. That's it, that's it. And then I'm just gonna jump and glide. No, I don't have enough momentum. Ah, oh, that's the worst. Come on, now, 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 now. Oof, no, 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 are you serious? Really? Ah, oh, that's the worst. I don't know why it's like that. How have I not had a hard time with this the first time through? Must have got lucky or something, because that's just ridiculous. 
See, was that so hard? It's sort of weird how the water works, because the water doesn't trigger until you're right over it. It just doesn't make any sense. But hey, we did it. I think this is the end right here, so we might just want to wait for this to plop up like that, and then we could. And let's see how that ends up working out. We should definitely be able to make that. That's just easier than having to do it the normal way. And we're good. Woohoo, don't fall off. Come on, Luigi, don't do that to me. <laughs> don't scare me like that. Oh, there's still a little bit more. Let's be careful then. Because I just I just don't want to mess this up. I just want to get to the end as easily as possible. I'm just gonna long jump over and boom. As easy as that, that's all it needs. Okay, so that level was the first one we've struggled on. But I'm glad to have gotten it done, that's for sure. And there's an extra life. Well, I lost a good few of them. Once again, not that big of a deal though. Alrighty, so let's move on to S24. This one could be a bit trickier. Sometimes these levels are easy, sometimes they're not, but I guess we'll find out. Okay, so I guess I'll get the little propeller thing. I don't quite need it. And I'll, oh, actually I might need it for this, you know, first little bit. But hey, right now, ooh, don't fall off, Luigi. Don't fall off. You just, it takes a lot to get used to his slippery movement, that's for sure. Okay, watch it, watch it. And what's inside of this one? Probably more of the same, yep. Ow, okay, that's fine. See, that's another good thing, is that we're allowed to take one extra hit, and that's always nice. All right, I'm gonna be way up here. I'm gonna slam back down, so I think all the question blocks are all gonna be that kind of stuff, which is fine. Don't really need it to be anything else all that much. Oh yeah, there is this. This is always fun, so I gotta do it. Yeah, <laughs> awesome. Okay, let's keep going. Going up this way. Yeah, we could get this, but it's just gonna give me a one up, so. I actually will get this this time. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. Whoop, there we go. And then fly up like that, do a little bit of a wall jump in action. Whoa, Oof. too many Goombas, too many. Oh, whoa, you know what? I, I'm not gonna risk it for those guys. I feel like I'm just gonna ground pound right into the abyss below. There we go. And oh gosh, watch it, Mr. Goombas. I got places to be, and they're not around here. I gotta go to the next level. So there we go, that one was really easy just to run through super fast. And with it, I think there's only two more levels left in this special world, so we should be fine. And then we'll be halfway through already, so we're still making some decent time. All right, so let's do S25 before we do S2 Airship, of course. And that's right here, so let's get to it. All right then, so our best time is 2.14. I think we'll be able to beat that, hopefully. Let's find out. So I just don't know exactly where I'm going is the thing. But it looks like over here, friend. I can actually just glide across for this one. Don't even need any extra help. I'm trying to avoid the bee at all costs, though, would be appreciated. Okay, so if I remember this correctly, oh yeah, oh, bouncing off that bee. I might not actually be able to get up there. Oh, I can't. Okay, I need the help of the other <laughs> bounce pads or whatever they're called. There we go. Yeah, and with this, I can if you're not rude, of course you're rude, you're a bee. I mean, not all bees are rude, but these ones are. In Mario World, they always are. <laughs> okay, um, grab this halfway point. Man, I'm so bummed that happened. Okay, I don't know which one gets us to the next area. I think it's this one? Looks like it. Ah, oh, man, every time things are going well, we lose our leaf. Let's get up this way, or not. Okay, no, I'm being trapped in. I'm being trapped in, come on. Ugh, this is gonna not be easy for time's sake. Gotta press all the buttons again. <laughs> that was just silly. Okay, ready and go, go and go. Head out this way right away. And we can just climb this little pyramid, I guess it is, of squares. Should be much easier. If this guy doesn't mess with me, which he does because he's a jerk. No! Okay, what the heck is with that? That is so not cool. Well, now the bee's gone, so you don't have to worry about it, I hope. But man, that is just so ridiculous. Like, what a precarious position to put him in. All right, so I could follow that, but I'd rather just go. Rather just go. Okay, moving and boom. So now I'm gonna be Tiny Luigi for the airship. That's not good. I mean, if we die, we'll just have to, you know, come back and we'll be back as bigger Luigi. But still, I want some power-ups here, game. Oh, well, guess that's what we get for rushing through. All righty, so let's move on to the airship. First airship of the day, actually, so that's pretty cool. And let's see how things go here. Special two airship. 255 lives. Hey, you have a tanuki leaf. You'd think you'd be able to give me one. But I guess not. Goodbye. 
All right, one of these has to have a power up, right? No, it has a poison mushroom. Thanks, game. I'm really feeling the love right now. Oh boy. Oh no, donut platform's falling. Um, okay, I'm. Pff. Slippery Luigi is a heck of a lot to get used to. <laughs> was there another? Yeah, I guess there wasn't. I'm trying to look around for where there could be a power up of any kind. There we go. All right, jumping across. Ooh, that was just barely well timed. Okay, I forgot about that. That was not well timed. Ooh, here we go, here we go, come on. You gotta be able to give me something good here if I can get them all in time, which at this rate, it's not looking like it. Oh, I got it, yes! Thank you, now don't get hit immediately. Awesome, <laughs> we're back in business. This is why I love red coins in this game. You can go from nothing to everything real fast. Okay, let's get this checkpoint, I guess. I mean, we could always go back if we need to. And then I will hit some of these guys, but also try not to be hit myself. Uh, yeah, I'll just get across to here. And this part's a bit tricky, that's for sure. Oh boy, very tricky. Because the only free spots of spikes are, you know, being bombarded by bonsai bills. Okay. Now, sort of the opposite here, the pits are where the bonsai bills are. We just have to stand where the falling platforms are, which is not as good. Oh yeah, and this one doesn't have a boss fight. Well, that's preferred. Go ahead and hop up this way, come on. And there we go. <laughs> I love the tiny little where it makes as we're sliding down the tiny bit of pole we climbed. All right, course clear. That one wasn't too bad. That was easier than the previous level, that's for sure. So our clear time is 97, don't think that's too bad. And now we can move on to Special World 3. Okie doke, save complete. So I'm gonna march on over this way, and as you can see, we have a Special 3-1. Okay, this level is a little tricky, I remember. I don't think it'll be too bad once we're rushing through it, but definitely getting the Star Medals for this one was a bit of a pain in the butt. Yeah, it has the, the big acre of woods behind us, and below us, and probably in front of us too. We just can't see that part. Okay. There we go, so far so good, but this is the easier part. Whoa, ooh. There we go, come on now. And we, hold on, got it, there we go. Oh no, oh no, oh, oh, no wait, no wait, no wait, no wait, no wait! No, come on, ah! That was just silly. Once again, the slippery controls really messed me up. I mean, it happens, but it's just silly. Oh, now that was gonna be much more difficult. But hey, maybe this will have a power up for us. I don't think so, yeah. Okay, don't get taken out here. Oh, I do see some red coins back to save the day. If we can get them all, we jump too high. Hold on, there we go, there we go. But now I'm gonna be running out of time. They don't give you much time for the red coins because there's only five of them this game instead of eight in like the uh, new Super Mario games. Uh, yeah, okay, that was actually really cool. All right, keep going. And we're getting closer to the end of the level, but also the tough part. Let me take a look around. Cause there's like a lot of stuff you could do here that you don't really have to for, oh no, oh no, oh no, it's gonna be close. That's it, that's it. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so we got a good ending. That's always good to see. So there's our course clear for the beginning of Special World 3. I think that was probably the hardest level of this world from what I remember. Let's hope that's the case because now I'm done with it. Next level I remember being pretty easy, especially if we're just gonna be running right through it. But we'll have to wait and see. Okay, Special 3-2. Let's go indeed. Usually these levels aren't too bad with this sort of kind of isometric, but not entirely isometric view from like above. You can just go across to here. And let's get to it. Got all these spinning platforms. Little blocks, I guess. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. Oh, oh yeah, just barely fit into there. Am I going the right way? Yeah, I guess this isn't the way to a star medal. I feel like we're getting close to the end already. Yeah, okay, well there's our half point. Halfway point. Uh, that was just some coins. Uh, if I can find an extra power up, I'll gladly take it. And I just don't know if I will. But what about this? Aha, okay, now we have a little bit of a uh, safety barrier, I guess. If we lose one, we have another to lose. <laughs> okay. Gotta keep going this way. Now we're getting real close to the end. Getting over here and ready, set, long jump. Oh, look at that, he even got to the top of the flagpole. Unintentional, but still good. All right, so yeah, easy level, not too much to worry about. 
And what do we got next? 78 seconds clear time. Not too bad, actually. All right, we're saving, and let's move over here. This is S33. Now this one, I don't think it's gonna be too tough, but definitely isn't something we can clear quickly. I mean, your best time's 89, so maybe I'm wrong, but we only have a little bit of time. Oh, not the bees again. I just don't like the bees anymore. I don't know if I like them to begin with because they've always been attacking us our entire adventure. Hold on, get up here. That's good, I guess. Watch it, buddy. Your personal boundaries, okay? All right, keep going. There we go, there we go. And got it. Okay, so we should be able to, okay, there's an extra power, but we needed it. Luckily, I don't yet. <laughs> Let's keep it that way. Good job, Luigi. Wait, I need to get this extra time, only the chance. And we're almost done. Whoa, whoa, that was weird. Because we gotta move forward a little bit. That's it. Okay, watch it, Biddy Bud. Oh, that's good. All righty, hoo wee. And then we can just run over this way as fast as we can, ready? And boom, we got it. Very cool. Oh, I love the background for this one, all the cool looking trees. Course clear, that one was a little stressful. We made it work. And we got a good clear time too, 65. All righty, so with that done, let's march past here. So let's see. Yeah, this doesn't have a clear rate at all on the bottom right. It doesn't tell us that we've cleared it with Mario, so I don't think we need to clear it with Luigi either. Um, so yeah, S34 going on now. Let's -a, Let a go indeed. This is sort of a haunted mansion, I guess not. It, it made the, the the closing door, but I think that just means it's like an indoors level or something. I don't really know. There we go. Got rid of that dude. Well, oh, these ones move quick. Oh, boomerang bros. I would rather you just not bother me. But you don't seem very keen on that idea. Oh, I almost walked right into that. That would have been bad. Okay, going in here. What do we got going on now? This sort of feels like more like a fortress. It's pretty cool. I like this level, or at least the theme of it. It's pretty fun. Going through like that. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, okay. Watch it. Okay, this is like playing jump rope, and it's very deadly jump rope, as you can see. I got hit. I'm gonna keep with what I have for right now. If I don't need to use that extra leaf, I'm gonna wait for sure. Cause like this stuff might be a pain to survive, but I can do it. And there we go. <laughs> I had a feeling I was gonna get hit again, which is why I didn't want to use the leaf. We will use it at the beginning of the next level. But there we go, another level done, and another one on the top of the flagpole. So we get some extra lives, which is good. I mean, at this rate, maybe we could get to like 260. I wonder if we could get the 300 by the end of all of this. That'd be pretty cool. All right, so we're mostly done with Special World 3. We got Special World 3, 5, and then another airship. I don't think we run into any boss fights on the airships until like, uh, special Ward five or six. Okay, this is definitely a level we wanna use this for, so that if we make a s mistake, I can instantly fall and waste it. Great. <laughs> it's not what I meant to do, I promise. And that was silly too. I keep on forgetting this is the one that's like one at a time instead of it being like one, two, three, disappear. So I just gotta, two, three, one, two, Three, oh, that's so weird with Luigi though. It's just so weird with him. Okay, watch it. I think this one has, no, that has a poison mushroom because this game's not nice. It's just a special worlds, man. They just know how to get you. All right, I'm back to having no power-ups. I don't know how I get myself in these situations so often, but I do. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, that's a mistake. Ugh, oh, come on. I know I'm trying to rush it, but it's very hard to time little jumps like that as Luigi because he jumps so high. Yeah, that was silly as well. Oh, nope. Uh, okay, it's working out, it's working out. Oh, oh my gosh, it's too stressful. Two, three, that's nice, okay. Let's get past him. And jump. Go, 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 go. One, two, yeah, if I can just get started on the third or the first one. Three, got it. Is there any power-ups up here? Doesn't look like it. Oh well. Booty slam right there, and we're good to keep going. Ain't too much of the level left now, but. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was silly. <laughs> A combination of good moves and bad moves. Back down to 253. Okay, that was, that was, that's not what I wanted. It just, it's so weird with Luigi, I promise. Especially since I'm like, I, I played through the entire game as Mario. So I'm just like, I, 
that that was just that was just me not jumping apparently. I don't have an excuse for that one. There we go. Okay, fool that guy a little bit. Fool his friend, or or both of them. The more the merrier, I suppose. Two, three, one, two, three. See, it's like by the time that I jump, it's like it's almost over. Okay, this is risky. Ooh, real risky. One, two. Oh, come on, there's no other way. There we go. Okay, you move it. I think there actually might be, no, there's not a power up up here. One, two, ah, come on. It's so tricky with the little pendulum moving around. Jeez Louise. Okay, so I just got another Tanuki Leaf and got back to this level. It took me only like a second to do because this level is really not bad when you have one. All you gotta do is just jump and glide and we should be fine. Yep, we're good, we're good. And if I don't need to get top of the flagpole, this should be easy as well. There we go. As easy as that when you have the leaf. That's why the level doesn't have one, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so the course is clear and we're good to move forward. I think only one more level left of this world and then we'll have one more level we'll left to go in today's episode. That should be fine. All righty, so moving on over to special three airship. I, I really don't think this one has a boss fight. Maybe special four has one, but this one should be pretty easy going. I mean, they're usually auto-scrolling, which is never that fun, but, I mean, the last one wasn't auto-scrolling. This one is, though. Okay. Well, if we could just get one extra power-up, that would help. We'll have to see if the game is that generous. This one's weird. Like, the auto-scrolling levels are always so weird in this game just because there's so little screen space for your character most of the time. What is this gonna be? Um, yes, okay, exactly what I wanted, but we're falling behind. Like, if you just lag behind for just a moment, you're already like really, really behind. It works a little bit better in the Mario platformers, because usually Mario takes up a much smaller amount of the screen. Ah, oh, in those kind of games. I think the perspective is a bit weird. Like, I thought I was gonna be like next to that, not right in its way. Are we done already? Okay, well that couldn't have been easier if I, if I, if I asked for it. That doesn't make any sense, but you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Special World 3 is done. Luigi can march right over to Special World 4. My favorite thing about this is that, like, I guess, like, story-wise, he's just playing through all these levels for fun, you know? No real reason. I mean, that was sort of the same thing with the entirety of Special World 2 through 8. Like, Special World 1, Mario was trying to save Luigi, but in all the other ones, it was just like, okay, let's just do this, why not? <laughs> all right, Special 4-1. Let me go ahead and get this power. Oh, I don't like this level. I remember, I'm actually, yeah, let me keep the boomerang for now. Luigi looks pretty cool with the boomerang suit though. But this one is just, you sit here and you wait on an elevator and then it eventually gets done. All right, Mr. Goombas, I need you to skedaddle. Oh, that not what I wanted. I pressed the button to throw it and it didn't get thrown. Well, that's not a good start. I really don't want to use the Snooky Leaf at all on this level. I'm gonna leave it be where it is. They can't even move the camera left to right. Like most little scrollers, you can still like move it left to right to sort of see what's around. But this one, you can't. I just don't like it. <laughs> it just takes forever, I'm being really tough. It's obviously something that's way more difficult if you want to get the star medals, because there are some tough ones. But even without, it's just sort of a pain in the booty. All right, get the Koopa, and I guess do that. Booty slam. Ah, oh, come on, that was a little unfair. Uh, what's inside of here? A poison mushroom, because that's absolutely very helpful. I remember that, oh, that's not what I wanted. Ah, oh, man, Luigi is so slippery. You just want to get to the edge so that I can lead it off the edge, it just, and that's what happens. All right, well, we get boomerang again. Lucky me. Um, don't fall off. If I'm a little bit more careful and I keep my distance, I should be fine. Just gotta wait for that first Goomba, get rid of him. And then, oh no, not what I wanted. Come back, come back. I need another boomerang. What is happening? I'm throwing, I'm pressing the button. Oh man, come on. Because these levels always make me lose my patience and then things go all sorts of bad. What's funny is that I can sort of just leave them be, I think. I can just leave them be and then they'll just get knocked off by the brick wall, which is awful. But you know what? They got rid of my boomerang, so I don't care. I mean, I guess he has a little Tanooki tail. He could probably just glide back to safety. Maybe, who knows. Okay, this is where I messed up before. Once again, I could just totally have them leave me be. If I don't want to fight them, now why'd I do that? I already knew it was a poison. Yeah, go over there. See ya. This brick is working as a great little clean cleaning thing. It's like a windshield wiper. 
Okay, we're going up now. I do see that there's two blocks over there, one block over here. Oh, they have piranha plants. Okay, well that, I was looking forward to those. Like, oh, I wonder what they'll have. Not anything good, apparently. Let me get rid of the coin pouch guy. And then these guys, I would like it if they would leave me alone. Okay, maybe one will explode the rest of them, or maybe they won't. That was scary. Oh, we got an extra life from that. No, Luigi, don't fall off! Oh, boy. It's just so hard to work in tight spaces with Luigi. It's, it's just such a tough situation. Oh, okay, they're gone. That's good. <laughs> oh, boy. I think some boomerang bros or something. Oh, these dudes are showing back up. Uh, okay, not too bad. Got it. Got it. Uh, okay, they sort of dunked into each other that time. That's good. Hey, don't jump back up. Yep, I thought so. Okay, we're almost to something. I'm not gonna bother jumping on that. I'm so gonna fall off. Oh yeah, I really don't like this part because it's basically impossible to tell like vertically where these are actually like, were they in front of me? Were they above me? It's impossible to really tell. Also, I can't, like I feel like the camera is wrong. It's a little bit farther back for some reason. Oh, there we go, cool. Well, we made it. That actually was a little bit easier than I anticipated. And that's a good thing. What's with the, like, the special, or the first levels of the special worlds always being the toughest ones? Not always, but most of the time. All right, well, we got that one done. So the first two worlds went swimmingly. The second two worlds, special world three and four, not so much. Now we got a ghost mansion, which usually ghost mansions aren't too bad when you're, when you're not trying to get the star battle. We'll have to wait and see. All right, well, here comes Shadow Mario, even though it should be Shadow Luigi. There we go. Oh gosh, no, are you kidding me? Every time, I should just never use my reserve leaf. Never use it. <laughs> I'm going this way now. And boom. That was just, I'm just so silly. <laughs> okay, leave me alone, Shadow Mario. I got places to be. Ooh. Oh, what is this gonna be? I feel like I should check. It's just coins. Really don't need coins right now. Okay, watch it. Oh, is there a star? I think there's a star around here. Yes, there is. Excellent. Come on, no, give it to me, give it to me. Because I know that if I get rid of this guy, he'll give me a Tanooki Leaf, and then if I touch Shadow Mario, which the best way to do that is just to stand still, he'll disappear for at least a little bit. Not forever, but at least a period of time, and that's good. So let's just try to be quick about this before Shadow Mario pops back up. He's like, hey, it's me. Which way am I going? I don't know which way I'm going. Uh, this way, apparently. Okay. Uh, we're going this way now. I don't want to get, that's just a way to the Star Metal. Come on, come on. I think we're getting close to the end, but I don't know that for a fact, so I just gotta be careful. Okay, now we're here. Okay, now we're at the end, for real. Anything there? Not quite. Okay, we did it. Ooh, we got out of there. Shadow Mario is still trying to bother me, but it's a little too late for you, buddy. Awesome. So that wasn't too bad. Definitely would have been a lot more difficult if we were trying to get the Star Medals, because Shadow Mario is sort of bouncing around you the whole time. But we did pretty good. We got a clear time of 95, and that means we can move to the next level, S43, which is right over here. We got bunches of bullet bills flying around. These uh, little beach type levels can be sometimes easy, sometimes tough. I think I do remember this one, be one being a bit of a challenge. Well, that's nice. Not what I was trying to do, but got an extra power up out of it. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, yep, excuse me, sirs. There we go. Oh, we're doing pretty good with that. Okay. Jump across to here. This is where the bonsai bills come in, though. Well, I can just plop back down here. We're fine, at least for now. Uh, we're, we're staying pretty far ahead of them, though. And then if I just jump and glide across like that, and then just keep going, I'm totally ignoring you. And go this way, I know you have another boomerang friend somewhere around here. I don't care. That was beautifully easy. Why can't we have more like that? That must have been a really good time. Like, under 60, maybe. We'll find out. 49, really good. Wow, that's awesome. Okay, so 49 for that one. Let's go ahead and move on to the next level. See, this is what I was hoping for. More levels like these, just zoom right through them. This is special 4-4. Four, four. I don't remember this one from the little uh, diorama it gives you in the overworld. Oh yeah, okay, this shouldn't be too bad. We just gotta defeat some Goombas along the way, which honestly isn't too much of a challenge. There we go. Got him. <laughs> All right, this is going pretty well. Okay, wait right here, and then jump and glide. Okie doke. And we should be able to make it over this way. Come on, come on, come on, come on, ready? And let's land right on top of him. 
<laughs> Oop. <laughs> Would have been so funny if I ended up messing up and losing my Tanuki Leaf again. But luckily, don't have to worry about it. And boom. That was a good one. Probably even better time. Like maybe even less than 49. I'll have to wait and see before I make such a, you know, crazy statement like that. 49 again, okay, well, I guess uh, I was sort of kind of not right, but also not incredibly wrong. All right, so what's the next level? It is S4-5, right before the airship. I'm pretty sure this airship has boss fights though, so I'm not looking forward to that, but we'll have to wait and see. For right now, we got this level to deal with. And these levels are usually pretty relaxing, but I have a feeling it might be a bit tough, because it's sort of a weird mix between a ghost mansion and not a ghost mansion. It's a cool mix, I like it. Oh, there's a star, come on, grabbing it. And I'm gonna long jump over this way. As much as we can, just ignore all these ghosts. Like, I probably could be getting a couple of, like, one-ups and stuff. Well, there's one. Oh, no. Ooh, just barely made it. Just barely. Okay. Ignore the dry bones as much as I can. And then we're getting up here. Excellent. And I think we're just about at the end. I'm just gonna ignore this giant boo. He's like, hey, wait! <laughs> You're supposed to run into me. Okay, and boom, perfect. So I think we're just about at the end here. Just, uh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. I gotta be more careful. Oh man, we were right there too. I got too confident from everything going so well. This is why I'm glad I had an extra one, but now I don't have an extra one. And that's where I gotta be very concerned. I mean, I know what I'm doing for everything up until then, which is good. There we go, okay, and boom. Once again, not bad. So just no long jumping, because I don't want to long jump right into the the depths below. Okay, Ooh, I don't really care about that last platform, I just want to make it safely there. Okay, still not too bad, even if I died once, the rest of the level was super duper not a problem. Okay, one more level left to go. Let's hope we don't mess up with the too bad. Now we're saving, save complete, very good, and let's check this out, S special for airship. Hopefully no boss fights, I'm hoping for it. I just don't remember this one. I like the sky though, nice shade of pink. Okay, so this one's not an auto scrolling level, which is a good sign for us. If we get an extra power up along the way, that'd be very helpful. I guess we can go into this pipe then. Oh no, wait, whoa, okay, there are boss fights, that's for sure. Oh no, okay, never mind. These are the the bros. There we go, come on, come on, and wait. That was weird, but I got him. Maybe I'll get the boomerang for now, just so that I have that leaf just protected where it is. And you, sir, need to skedaddle. That's just a mushroom. Don't need the mushroom. I don't know if it'll go over the leaf or not. I don't trust it, so I'm just gonna leave it be. Whoa, excuse me. Got places to, be. ow, B. I think this will give me a leaf though. Now it gives me a fire flower. I'll take it. Oh, I do remember this though. This is definitely a boss fight area. I remember being really stuck here because of the boss fight. Yeah, it's, is it both of them or is it just one? I think it's both of them. Oh no, maybe not. Just boom boom, oh you know what it is? It's boom boom and then it's pom pom afterwards. There we go, I got you. I got you. This can be a bit tricky. But, oh yeah, this is where it gets tricky. All right, boom, boom. Stay back, buddy. Oh, I just barely hit you with any of those. Okay, he's dizzy. I can't quite hit him on the spikes, but I can have the fireballs in him, just like that. He's down and down again. Jump. Okay. Oh, he's just trapped in here with me. I don't like it. Usually this part's easier. Come on, come on. Not, none of those are hitting him. Oh, come on. That was baloney. I think he knows it too. Okay, I need to go and boom, got him that way. Oh, come on, I was trying to jump off it. That was so silly. But I guess that's why I have this, because I think we're running into a pom-pom boss fight next. So, I'm gonna get that, all these coins, and then we're gonna get through this pipe. Oh, <sighs> yep. This shouldn't be too bad because we had the leaf, but if we mess up and we you know, lose the leaf, this becomes a whole lot more difficult. I do consider pom-pom an easier boss, though, just because of her you know, her being attacked phase after you hit her once, she jumps up in the air and slams down on you like this, which is much easier to deal with than uh, Boom Boom's like bouncing around. And then she, yeah, she hops out, flies back over here. And I basically probably just wanna go back over here. And if we just run in circles, 
I mean, it can be a bit of a worry because this is such a small platform, I might just end up looping around too much. Okay, then all we gotta do is slam and miss and almost slam right into the <laughs> into the pit that I made. Oh boy. Okay, we made it. No, not what I wanted. There we go. And here we go, here's the end of the level. All right, so Special World 1 through Special World 4 have been fully complete as Luigi with all of the uh, flagpoles. We don't need to get any type of kind of other thing, so that's good. Uh, we just completed all the levels, which is great, which means next episode we'll do Special World 5 through Special World 8, and then we'll be fully done playing every single level as Luigi, unlocking the 100% ending level, or something like that, I think it's something. But uh, yeah, that was very cool, but also very intense. <laughs> All right, well, only four more worlds left to go and we'll tackle those in the next episode of Super Mario 3D Land. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment flagpole zebra so you've watched the end of the URA zebra task. If you were to check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the zebra herd out of the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.